The Word of God tells us that there will be some people who will never experience death on this earth. This is not something that has happened yet, but will happen someday, maybe soon. Though no one knows the day or hour of our Lord's return, we do know that He is coming soon. Most of us will probably leave this earth by dying, but there will be those who will be alive when He returns. Those Christians will experience a rapture that will astonish all who are left on earth. These are the ones who will have never experienced physical death. In 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, 13 through 18, the Apostle Paul explains that both Christians who have previously died and those still alive at the Lord's return will participate in this event together. The scripture says, Brothers and sisters, we do not want you to be uninformed about those who sleep in death, so that you do not grieve like the rest of mankind who have no hope. For we believe that Jesus died and rose again, and so we believe that God will bring with Jesus those who have fallen asleep in Him. According to the Lord's word, we tell you that we who are still alive, who are left until the coming of the Lord, will certainly not precede those who have fallen asleep. For the Lord Himself will come down from heaven with a loud command, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trumpet call of God, and the dead in Christ will rise first. After that, we who are still alive and are left will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air, and so we will be with the Lord forever. Therefore, encourage one another with these words. So whether we die a physical death or are still alive when the Lord returns, we will participate in this great and wonderful event. We will be caught up in the air with Him. Until then, let us comfort and encourage each other with this hope. And may we live each day with our hearts and minds on things above, not on earthly things. May the name of our Lord Jesus Christ be praised forever and ever. Amen.